With this week's summer road trip being in Beulah, we have been learning about what makes this city stand out. This weekend will be filled with nonstop small town North Dakota fun. Nakaya Carrero is here to tell us what people can expect this weekend in the Power Belt. Nakaya. Hi, Brooke and Nicholas. People from all over the country have returned to Beulah this weekend for one reason, Beulah High School's all-class reunion. And after being postponed last year due to the pandemic, it's back bigger and better. Approximately 500 alumni are returning home to Beulah to celebrate school spirit. Beulah's 12th all-class reunion is not just a celebration amongst classmates, but also families. Um, and it's also nice um, in small towns, you often have multi-generational um, situations. So um, many of our parents went to school in the same school that we went to, and, and many of our children are going to the same school that we went to. And, and so it's nice to be able to bring everyone together. Biesterfeld says with communities like Beulah, you see many people move away after graduating high school. So an all-class reunion not only allows people to reconnect with each other, but also the community. Um, it's also great to get people into the community. Um, you know, it's, it's always wonderful for the community for um, to have events like this that, that bring people to town. Um, you know, great for tax dollars, but also just great to see people. We, we love to have people come visit our community. The reunion typically takes place every five years, but after having to be pushed back a year, the anticipation for the weekend long celebration has people coming from near and far. So the one that stands out the most, I was so shocked to get this one, is um, there's a lady from 1947, the class of 1947 that is showing up. Um, she is flying in um, from Arizona for the event and um, I'm so happy that, um, you know, that somebody um, of that age is, is going to come and join us. The school is currently under construction as they have built a new building. And while the old building is currently being torn down, people will have the opportunity to tour the new one. Brooke and Nicholas, back to you. Akaya, thank you very much.